Hey, what's going on? It's Dean Valentine, and we're down at Bayshore right now, taking your questions for Jump's greatest gig on earth as we search for Tony Stark's new morning show co-host. Let's go, shall we? So, Tony, man, you've been here since what, 1 o'clock? Yeah, got here around 1, yeah. So uh, it's 5.15 now. <laughs> you must have met some pretty good characters so far today. Yeah, for sure. I met some couple of really, really good characters. People came out and they said, what do you need to do to like get my attention? And it's just your personality. So whatever makes you cool, put that on the video and just like make it 90 seconds. And one of the good, big questions is, do I need to know a lot about like radio to get into it? Nothing. None. You don't know any. I don't know any. We're part of a program. I probably shouldn't have said that a lot. We're turning up the rocks right now in Ottawa, man, because we know the perfect person's out there. Is it you? Could be. Could you picture yourself working in radio? Sure. What makes you special, man? Like, what makes you, you? I'm a passionate person. I can see that by looking into your eyes. Very deep, oceany blue. I'm a little jealous, I'm not going to lie. Is this creeping you out? No, no. Because these are the sort of things you got to deal with, you know? Especially this stare. That's a yeah, that's the one. That yes, I have. <laughs> How do you feel about sneakers? I feel pretty good. You like sneakers? Yeah. How much do you drop on an average pair of sneakers? I don't know, 100 bucks. 100 bucks? He might accept that. <laughs> All right, so I'm being joined by... Luke Minani. All right, Luke, so you're interested in Jump's Greatest Gig on Earth. I am, yeah, very interested. I think... Uh... I think I got the personality for it. So you got you want to be on radio. So what makes you special, man? Tell me a little bit about yourself. I mean, the fact that I am a graduated student. I'm uh, outgoing. I look great. I feel great. You do look good. <laughs> I'm just gonna say, the handsome levels right here. The 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 scale is very tipped right now. You're making me look bad, man. Larger than life personality. Too. I don't know if we can have him. He looks too handsome. I think, I think you should have me because I'm so handsome. Are you willing to wake up at 3.30 in the morning every day? Yes, I will be. Would he be a lot sexier if he got to go to every concert and took you with him? Oh, for sure. <laughs> Not that you're, you're sexy. I mean, just look at his face. If I was a lady, mm. So how long do you have you wanted to work in radio? Uh, forever. I actually went to uh, Seneca College this summer uh, to take a broadcast journalism program. I got my certificate. I made it. And uh, now I've just been looking for a job ever since. And I feel like this has been, this is unreal. Like, I'm so happy that this competition came out and uh, I decided to just take a leap and go for it. But it's been, it's been a dream forever. Um, I love people. I, I'm so passionate just, you know, getting to know people and sharing that with, um, with the people of Ottawa would be fantastic. All right, I'm joined with... Tristan Morrison. Tristan, how's it going, man? Not too bad. So right now we're looking for Tony Stark's new morning show co-host on Jump 1069. You ever pictured yourself working in radio? I didn't really, but uh, I am a charismatic person. I love talking to people. I love being social. I like to think of myself as a funny person, and uh, it would be an ideal job for me, not going to lie. So check it out. So if you want to be like one of us and just like hang on the radio, talk some trash, have some fun, make some people a little upset, that's what Jump's all about.